Shall I start, just start right in? Go, yeah, go, okay, go. <laughs> no, you travel around the world so much and uh, you're always encountering people who perhaps never heard of us, don't really fully understand who we are. What questions do you find that people have about Seventh-day Adventists? Quite commonly as I travel, uh, I find myself sitting next to somebody on an airplane who was, and in the course of the conversation about uh, what we do and so forth, uh, I say, uh, I'm a minister of religion and I work for the Seventh-day Adventist Church. And they will typically respond, Seventh-day what? Um, who are you? Who, who, uh, tell us about this. So what, where do I start? What do I want the a stranger whom I meet like this, to think of, first of all, when I talk about Seventh-day Adventists. We are a faith community. Our spiritual lives and spiritual values will always be important. We will witness, that is what we are called to do. Therefore, evangelism will always have a very, very high priority in everything we do as a church. So these things will always be prominent. They will know us as a faith community with commitment and engagement in sharing and witnessing our faith. But I want them to know something more about us. I don't want them to think that we are so engaged in eternal, maybe even distant things, that we have no interest and commitment to the present things. The realities in life as they are here and now. I want the public to know Seventh-day Adventists as a spiritual community committed to God and committed to people, that we, this is where we live now, here in this world. That is a world of, of education, it's a world of, of health and illness, it's a world of development aid programs, it's, a, it's an extremely diverse world. And we are a global community, we are spread everywhere around the world. We have a huge commitment as a church to improving the quality of life in every community where we find ourselves. So, I want the public, and I say this also to government officials whom I meet on my journey, I want them to know Seventh-day Adventists as a community-friendly people, as an asset to the government, as good partners in community building. We have a strong program in education. I want them to know that. We have a strong commitment to building good health, health ministries. I want them to not just know about it, I want them to experience it. And particularly in the developing world, they do. And we have a commitment to a development aid work, which is a global work that we are engaged in. So I would hope, I try um, to represent the church in a manner so that the people who hear Seventh-day Adventists will say, ah, oh, yes. Not only did they hear a Seventh-day Adventist evangelist, not only did they see a Seventh-day Adventist uh, faith program on television, but they know about us from our numerous encounters with the communities in which we are placed. And they can think and they may feel, yeah, Seventh-day Adventists, actually, they're good people. I'd like to get to know them a bit better. So these are the values that you hope that will be not, we can become known for. But how then do we effectively communicate them as, as individual church members and perhaps as local congregations? What are the most effective ways of communicating those values to the community? I think that the local congregation may well say, well, you know, we are not into the big things. We are not, we are not running a hospital. We are not here. We are not in, involved in, 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 in uh, politics or community building. And that's, how can we... Um, represent the church a right to the community in which we are placed as something more than a confessing, witnessing faith community. Well, I think for a start, you can by being friendly and open and outreaching to the community. I think there are many churches uh, that is able to do this effectively by, by having uh, initiatives, uh, that they invite the community to come in, not only to a service, spiritual service, but they can come in for an uh, event that may take place. It may be a concert, it may be a, it may be a celebration, whether it be of Christmas or some other occasion, that they can make deliberate efforts to reach out and bring the community in. And when they come in, 
please be friendly to them. Show warmth. Show that you, we, we are ordinary human beings with a huge heart and with a, a, a passion to develop good relationship with the community.